This is a public parking lot. Yeah, because it's funded it's by not. taxpayer. It's not. Y you're wrong. It's not. You're wrong. You're sadly mistaken, pal. Okay. You're sadly mistaken. Okay. Why don't okay. we get a supervisor out here? Uh, why don't we walk also, over here where you're allowed to I'm, be? I'm, I'm or we gonna can have an issue. Reasonable, articulable suspicion. I never heard those two words used together. Wow, that's kind of scary. Videotape. You don't see that as being suspicious? They're, they're telling me that I'm detained. Yes, until I can figure out who you are. Interesting. Okay, this is an unlawful detainment, just so you know. You just go to random people and say you're detained? Enough. You don't need to sit here and argue, okay? You guys are all set. Hey, what's up, guys? Long Island Audit here, back again with another installment of Throwback Thursday. Today's video takes place at the police headquarters in Newburgh, New York, one of the most uneducated and ignorant agencies I've ever encountered. Make sure to stick around to the end of the video for my analysis. Let's get into it. Hey, how are you today? Good, how are you? Uh, you working here or something, or? Mm -hmm. oh, oh, yeah, te technically, yeah. Okay. Am, but... <laughs> Can I help you with anything? No, I don't need any help with anything right now. Okay. Can I get your name and badge number, though? Sure, Kuhn, K U H N Shield 17. Can I ask you what you're doing? 17. I'm just taking video and picture. How you doing, uh, sir? Uh, what? Hey, so what? We got a, we got a parking lot. Myself and uh, Officer Kuhn. So How you buddy, doing? You're not, get, to be, you're not can, allowed to be in this area. Can Can I get your name and badge number? Uh, you can You can read it right there, but you're not allowed to be. You're not allowed to be in this area. You have any business here? I do have business here. Yeah. What's your business? I don't have to tell you that. What's your business? I don't have to tell you. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's your business? So relax, man. It's not a bit. It's not that. It's not that big of a deal. No, it is a big deal because you're not allowed to be in this area. This is for authorized personnel only. That's so not. If you'd like to go in the in the lot. That's not true. There's there, there. there 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 is there is no uh, there's no sign saying authorized personnel only. So. No, you, well, I'm telling you that. So you can go into the. No, parking you you lot, can't just. This is this is a this is a public this is a public parking lot. So no, what not. happens is Geyer. Guy, no, is that not. how I say that? It's this not. is this is a public parking it's lot. Not. Yeah, because it's funded it's by taxpayer. Not. It's not. Y you're wrong. It's not. You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. Listen, buddy, we can go take a walk over here, and you can go stand over there. We can have this conversation. You can, you no can take a walk over there if you'd like. There is no signs deeming this a restricted area. I'm telling you. Yeah, you can't do that. I'm just, telling you. You can't. You can't just deem an area restricted okay, that's open okay, to so the then, public. So then maybe you're having a hard time listening. Okay, that's what the issue could be here. No, I'm just trying to tell you, bro. I don't think we can that's go take it. Take a walk over here. Yeah, that's it. You're not allowed to be over here. Yeah, no, I understand. But what I'm telling you is you can't just make an area restricted. Yeah, I'm in a lot it of has areas. to be restricted already. This is not a restricted area here. No, you're, you're sadly mistaken, pal. Okay. You're sadly mistaken. Okay, why okay. don't we get a supervisor out here? Uh, why don't we walk over here where you're allowed to be I'm, I'm, I'm we gonna... can have an issue? Oh, what's the issue? Is that a threat? No, th th that, I'm telling you right now, you're no, not allowed not. to be in this area, bro. I, I understand what you're saying, and I'm asking no, for a supervisor. You're not I'm understanding. I'm asking for a supervisor. You're not understanding. Does your policy not state? That's what I'm saying. I think you're having a hard time. Does your policy state? Do you have like you have you have issues or something like? No, hearing? I think I think you have. You have, issues have hearing? I think you have. I think you have you're some anger issues, buddy. You're not allowed to be buddy. in this area, dude. This I guy came over here. Come over here and walk over here. There's there's a complete difference. See, this is the contrast in America of. You got cops okay, like you, yeah, yeah. and then you got cops so, like okay. you. Listen, cops sir, who want to escalate to, and cops who want okay. to de-escalate. There's to a difference. Okay. Nice that's how good saying. cops get hurt, sure. because people like sure. you, okay. when they go in all gun ho sure. okay. Let me finish what I'm well, saying. I was just finished what I'm saying. Can I have your ID, please, so we know who we're talking to? No, you're not going to get my ID. I haven't committed a crime. Unless I've committed a crime. You're trespassing, just like our guys said. So you see this, this area. Why do you think the public's not here? Why do you think the way walks Because they're choosing not to be here? No, it's not because they're not This is not a restrict... This is not a rest it's we're authorized, we're trying, authorized. We're you, man. I don't need to go look at it. I, I read it already. Here, authorized person. vehicles and only. No, 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 no. Authorized vehicles. Yeah. I am not in a vehicle, as you can Watch see. Watch out, your shoes are untied. I don't want you to slip and fall on it. Okay, I'm fine. This is not, I'm not in a vehicle. Okay. So here's the problem. Authorized so here, vehicles. So here's the problem. You're not, you're telling me, you're not going to tell me your business, right? That's what you're telling me? I'm, I'm telling you right oh, now that I'm a journalist. Me. I'm going to tell you, I'm a okay. journalist working on a story. And that's as, that's okay. as much as I'm going to say. But you're I'm engaging, to tell me. I'm engaging so, in a constitutionally but protected you're activity. you're telling me who you are, correct? Because I, got I, a I, because I don't hold have on, to. Hold on, Because right now you're a complete stranger. I got a stranger over my work area, walk around video. Yeah. I have no idea what your intentions are, correct? Yeah. Correct? Yeah. I have no idea. Because you know what's not normal? There's a guy. Where's your credential? If you're a journalist, that's fine. Where's your credential, sir? You don't. You don't need. You don't need. You don't need credentials, and I don't need to provide you with anything unless you have reasonable. Unless you have reasonable, articulable suspicion that I've committed a crime. I'm about to commit a crime. Reasonable, articulable. Did you learn that in training or no? Okay. So reasonable. You don't use that over here. We don't use that phrase. I mean, every every police. Reasonable, articulable suspicion. I never heard those two words used together. Wow, that's kind of scary. No, that's kind of scary. I, I'm just saying. 
it's it, it's very important to your job because you can't do anything without that, without reasonable well, articulable I, I suspicion. Touch touch you no, you said, well, who said you touched me? I didn't say you touched me. You're the only person, and I don't know intentions in our work area. We're not supposed to be videotaping. You don't see that as being suspicious. There is there is nothing preventing me from being here. Number one. Number two. I'm engaging in a constitutionally protected activity, such as filming. It's so, a constitutionally okay. protected activity. Okay, I am. Not, I'm an independent. Nobody's told you not to film. I'm, that I'm an independent journalist, uh -huh. and I'm gathering content for a story. Nobody's told you not to film. Correct. I'm I don't not know saying why that. You me, but I'm trying to find out where you're here. You're being evasive. Okay. I'm, I you're just told you that. I just okay, told you everything I need to tell you. I'm just trying so we can engage who we're talking to. We can keep ourselves safe, right? So I, mean, I can know who I'm talking I, to. I never. Uh, you guys. You guys are the ones with the weapons, not me. You guys should feel. What does weapons have to wait? Because you're saying you don't feel safe with with a guy with a camera. Come Why on, man. In the, in the middle of broad daylight. Nobody's okay, and what are you going to do with the video, right? Because now I... Here, listen to me. So now I got a subject. Videotaping comings and goings. Videotaping entire layout of this parking lot. Yep. What am I supposed to say people are going to do with that? I don't Just know. My shoes. You, you could get it from Google Maps if okay, you wanted to. Come care, on, man. I, I'm not worried about Google Maps. I'm worried <laughs> about a subject here who is yeah. just telling me his name. Yeah, I'm, okay. a, I'm a good citizen. That's what I am. I'm okay. a good citizen Did anybody here. say you weren't? I'm not saying... But listen, you're being evasive. All... I told you what I'm here to do. How am I being eva okay, evasive? So would be, evasive would be, evasive would be, I'm not going to, okay, well, well we'll listen, we'll evasive would, evasive well, would be, I'm not going to answer your questions and then spin off and walk away from you because no, you have no authority listen, here. Nobody, nobody, nobody's trying to, listen, here's, here's the bottom line. Maybe, I told you what maybe, I'm doing. Maybe you're, maybe, once again, I'm, I'm just trying to explain to you. This area, you got to, you got to understand where we're coming from, all right? There's cops that are getting ambushed and shot every single day, okay? Just, it, okay. just, just, just like, that. Just like there's like people that. being killed by cops every single day. Yes, Absolutely. it works both ways. It does, uh -huh. 100%. Not disagreeing with And you, I understand man. that. Well, I'm just telling you right now, from our standpoint, you're asking why we're approaching you, asking you questions. No, 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 no. See, that's, that's where you're mistaken. Okay. I, I, I fully so, expect, so I fully, start, I, fully, I, fully I fully expect you, I fully expect you to do your job and so, come so up listen, to me and ask questions. That's what I expect. Being somebody who I am, okay, I'm... I work with, uh, as a part of what my gig is, is I make sure that I facilitate the bond between the community and policing. So how about this? Really? I can, I can offer you, I can offer you a little bit more help, but once again, we need to know who we're speaking with and what, what type of credentials you have as far as what type of project you're working on. So I, listen, I just man, told you. if you have, it, it could be to the point, you want to come on a ride along, we'll take you on a ride along, man. Yeah. It could be to that point. Is that, it's a, is that's that's not, but that's not what I want to do at this moment. But, but, it, but if you're walking, but I'm just saying, if you're walking around in an area that's for authorized personnel only, mm -hmm. and you're not, you're, you're not explaining. But that's, that's not true. I, I read the sign. What does the sign say? Recite it says, it word for word. authorized vehicles only, authorized there is no I'm not in a vehicle I'm on what foot what else does it say authorized vehicles only that's okay, what it so says so, okay. so let me ask you this, this I'm not in a vehicle let me push a hypothetical right I mean, this is, so, you know, so, you that, say, so so you think at this point you could just walk in all around that station right you can walk in go wherever you want no well, well why hold on well why because you have locks okay. on certain hold doors hold on but why but is there any sign saying you can't well, if you yeah. lock the door. So hold on, but there's an expectation, okay? That's what I'm getting. There's an expectation. You're telling me you can't freely walk through that building, right? Because it's a police station, right? No, because because, there, because you on. set up you set hold up on, barriers. Me. I'll let you finish. Go You've ahead. You had your chance. I'll let you finish. Okay, because there's an expectation that that's not normal, right? You see anybody else just walking through here? Because it seems normal to walk through here. But what's normal to okay. you, it might not be normal to me. What's weird to you might be, you know. Well, you know, it's it, it, this is we have that's, this that's is this so, is the United States of America. So, we we so can have difference of opinion. Let me ask you this: So yeah. most journalists, right? They want to come and they want to do stories. They want to get information. Yeah. You know what they do? They call up and they make appointments. So that way, guess what you could do? You could walk around here and say, "Hey, officer." But why would I do that? Why would I do well, that yeah. when I can do it anyway? Why would I call if I could just do it anyway? We wouldn't be doing this, would we? I mean, you could do this all you'd like. I, am I am I detained? Uh, right now, yes, until we figure out for sure what you're doing, So, yes. you're telling me that I'm detained? Yes, until I can figure out who you are. Interesting. Okay, this is an unlawful detainment, just so you know. Okay, okay. until I can figure out what your true intentions are. You're telling me a journalist so you can you, no can you can you tell me what crime, can you articulate a crime that I've committed? I don't have to detain you for a crime. You're, this is suspicious so, right now. So this is suspicious, suspicious Is suspicious a misdemeanor or a felony? Not suspicious activity right now. I gotta try to find is, out what is you're doing. Is suspicious activity, sir, a misdemeanor or a felony? Oh, it all depends on how you want to speak. It all depends on what you're doing, doesn't it's, it? It's, it's neither. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what your business is. It's neither. Is, I, don't, I don't know why. It's neither. I'm here. I'm here conducting my own business. Now I'm not free to leave. I'm being detained against my will, unlawfully, listen, for listen. no crime I've committed. 
Until we can prove what you're I'd doing. like to speak to a supervisor, please. Absolutely. And since I'm being detained, and since I'm being, since I'm being detained, since I'm being detained, I'm gonna. Absolutely. Well, supervisor can talk to you. Yeah. I mean, it, it could have just been really easy, man. You could have just told us what you're you guys, doing. you guys are going above and uh, uh, above and beyond your authority. You have no authority to detain me. None. Dude, Zero. Listen, when I have a stranger walk around where I work, that's not true. Hopefully, you'll learn you something are a today. I don't know you. Has it doesn't matter true? if I'm a stranger or not. It doesn't matter. That what does that matter? Normal activity. You you Nobody enforce you that. enforce the law. If I'm not you breaking any laws, man, you have no business with me. There's people coming in and out of here. As far as cars coming in and out, you can get yourself hurt. All right, so you, you don't. Yeah, I, but I, I, I'm, I'm a grown man and I know how to walk through a parking lot. Well, your shoes are untied. You're grown, but your yeah. shoes are untied. I don't they're, really. They're, that doesn't okay. really go hand in hand with you. Okay. Me. It doesn't. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. Because I told you your shoes are untied. I'm trying to explain to you. And okay. You just, you, you're just so refusing to give us any information. I walk in. He's walking right, around. Hey, how are you, sir? Sergeant. And going through. So I come over, try to talk to him, try to engage him. Can you take me off of uh, this unlawful detainment, Sergeant, before. I'm I'm being unlawfully detained, so. Just, you're not being detained. We're just yeah, no, to he, he, move on no, way, no. Man. This guy told me I was no, being no, detained. I think, listen, I told him he's staying here, trying to figure out what he's doing. He just want to get his name. With so I'm sure, as the he's sergeant would know, going, you no can't detain me a, for no uh, reason. A journalist. I am a journalist. All work areas, over by this is public. Areas. This so, is public. You know, things things have been you know up and down. But you know, city journalist doesn't want to provide any sort of credentials. Doesn't want. To I don't have to. That's why. why I've been very, very decent with you guys, though. I, 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 you said you haven't been disrespectful. We're yeah. just trying to figure out what you're doing. No, but you, but again, what you're but again. what you're doing right now, officer, is that you're, you're you're violating my rights. I'm a free man, and you're telling me that not I'm detained. When you're conducting suspicious behavior. That's not a I crime, sir. You, you have to but learn the law, crime, sergeant. Can I you can please? I want. I I would appreciate it if you could if you could please. You know, de-escalate this and. Um. My officers are doing the right thing. You're in our parking lot, taking photographs and everything. Not illegal, mm -hmm. okay? But certainly something for us to be concerned about, okay? Which is There's okay. There's a lot of attacks against police. There's a lot, sure, of, a lot yeah. of stuff going on. In the There's world a lot today, of stuff going right? on. If I'm, I'm not so everybody's you're part. you're here with your phone. This is, I mean, it's not fenced in or anything like exactly. that. Exactly. But not necessarily just open to the public. Okay. Well, unless this it's our, unless it's unless it's restricted. Private, this is our private okay. lot. I'll let you finish. Right? There are signs mostly for vehicular traffic, mm -hmm. but it does say unauthorized people not not uh, allowed to come in. Vehicles, vehicles. vehicles. I, I read I this said that. It's mostly for vehicles. Yeah. Okay. But again, this is why you were stopped. Yeah. Is because it's not necessarily illegal what you're doing, mm -hmm. but certainly a little suspicious as to why. If someone just showed up at your house, granted that's private property, a little bit different. Yeah. But or uh, say you're parked in in Walmart, right? And someone you come outside. Someone's taking pictures of your car, looking inside of your car, yeah. checking things out. You'd be like, "Hey, man, what what are you doing?" Uh -huh. Right? Yeah. And, and like and like I told your officers, I have no problem with them coming up and making contact with me, sure. voluntary contact. But when it comes to the point of a um, an unlawful detainment, now you're now you're holding up my freedom of movement. Okay, well, we're 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 investigating what was going on. Okay. Yeah, but in all, in all as a sergeant, you should know that you know your your officer here didn't know what reasonable articulable suspicion was. So, you know, he said he's never heard of it. You guys don't use that here? Is that true? No. What I said was I never heard the way you described it. First of all... Reasonable, articulable said. suspicion. You said you didn't know what that was. No, no. As far as how we conduct business, we don't conduct business... Well, and I'm going gonna, to teach you something. In order, in, 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 in order to detain somebody, you need reasonable... Articulable that's suspicion. That's, that's not. That's not speaking the way speak I that. do. Like you just said, everybody's different. Right? So how, when you detain that, somebody, what's your what's your burden of proof? What do you have? What do, what do you said, do? You just say you just go to random. Guys, hey, you just stop. go to random people and say you're detained. Enough. You don't need to sit here and argue. Okay, you guys are all set. All right. You guys can go. All right. Take care, guys. Stay safe out there. Okay. Sarge, listen. So, I'm just all I'm doing. I'm not. I have no ill intent. Look, you're I'm not just, being violent. You're not being. No. You're not even being argumentative. You're not. You're not. You're free. You're recording me. That's fine. You're also being recorded. I'm I sure know. you already know that. Mm -hmm. So, again, just explaining to you. Yeah. At, at first, we want to try to find out. I'm not going to try and force you to give me your name. I'm mm -hmm. not going to try and force you to give me identification and I appreciate or that. anything like that. Okay. But you have to understand what you're doing, while not technically illegal, is a little concerning to us. Yeah. Okay. We don't know if you're trying to to sabotage our cars. We don't know what you're doing out here. Which, like I said, I'm I'm a, I'm a reasonable person, mm -hmm. and I could understand that. Some guy walking around your parking lot, filming your vehicles, filming the building, like you said, completely legal to do. I'm not mad that they came up to me. I'm mad in the form that they came up to me. They came up to me, hey, where's your ID? 
this and that, you're being detained. That's an unlawful detainment and you know it, Sergeant. But like I said, it's not a big deal, it's five minutes. It, it, I just, I prefer the education. If you could just next time tell them, hey, listen, you can't just detain people willy nilly. That's not how the world works. Well, you are right about that. You know what you I mean? Can't you can't just tell people you're, you're detained. For, yeah. For no for, reason. For, for sorry, not, reason. especially when you know I'm not breaking the law. You just said it yourself. You're so. not breaking the law, but you're, you're but, acting. But you could talk. And listen, when you guys came up to talk to me, could I have not have just said, hey guys, what's up? And just kept walking Absolutely. and not stopped? Sure. Because I don't have to stop for you. It's, this is a vol you're right now, this is a voluntary interaction, you're right? Absolutely correct. So, but I stopped and talked to you guys to try and quell the fears. I try and say, hey, listen, I know, you, you, you under, you, I know you're worried that I'm filming the cars. I'm a journalist. I'm ga gathering content for a story. Okay. That's it. And I'm no ill intent, nothing like that. I'm just filming the police station, uh, around the police station, mm -hmm. the different cars. I've never what, been here what, before. What, uh, what I'm independent. Oh, I'm independent. Okay. I'm independent. Yeah. You have like a blog or whatever, uh -huh. something mm -hmm. like online, yeah, yeah, yeah. stuff like that. Okay. I have a bunch of outlets online that I post to. Yeah. Okay. Uh huh. And you're doing so, what, what specific story are you doing? Well, to be honest with you, the story it's it's on the police department, right? But you know, it's about it's, our it's, specific it's police department. About your specific to police okay. department today. Yeah, I do this to a bunch of different police departments. Okay. And the whole point is is to highlight a sergeant like yourself who came in and de-escalate the situation. Mm -hmm. And to, you know, hold people accountable, like your officer over there who wanted to escalate the situation uh, and, and he didn't, and, and he didn't know what, you know what reasonable to, articulable suspicion two, is, correct? Yes. There's okay. Two, there's two ways to, to, for these situations to be handled. Look, I, I've watched a lot of these videos where yeah. you get the people, I'm not saying this is you, but you yeah. do get the people who want, who are, Agitators. are yes. trying to get some sort of reaction, mm -hmm. a, normally a, a negative reaction, yes. because it's good views mm -hmm. for their things. Exactly. I, get, I get all that. Exactly. Okay, but but the point, but well, what I want to make very clear to you, Sarge, is that you know obviously you guys doing stuff that you're not supposed to is going to get views. But what I tr what I try and do is I'm trying to say, hey, listen, I'm going to be reasonable. I'm going to talk to you. I'm not going to spin off. I'm not going to curse mm -hmm. at you. I'm not going to do anything that's going to try. I'm not going to try and ag aggravate you. I'm just going to try and just stand firm in my rights and, and, and just do what I need to do in I a respectful that. manner, respect in a respectful that. manner. And then whatever your officers or whatever police department I'm filming at that particular day decides to do, it's on them. You know, people, there are people who do what I do and they, you know, like yeah. to agitate a little bit and, you know, they like to, Look, hey. There's good, there's good and bad in, in every both, profession. In every profession, right? exactly. So. And my profession, what I'm doing, is like I said, if they want to go crazy, yes, that is good views. But what I'm saying is, you don't. It doesn't have to be that That's way. Not your point. I I, per, you. I prefer to have a good conversation like I'm having with you right now, Sergeant. Like I prefer to listen. listen I well, I can understand my, that it's my, my, concerning. My, I wouldn't even say suggestion or a request. Maybe mm -hmm. if you do this again, I'm sure you're going to be doing it again. Yeah. Maybe stop in. Yeah. And be like, hey, you know, this is what I'm. This is what I'm going to be doing. I'm not saying you're going to come in, show ID, and all that yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, you say you say you're a journalist. It's like a private. Mm -hmm. you, you, you work for yourself, so you're mm -hmm. not gonna you're not gonna have a, any kind of. Yeah. I mean, I could print anything, something up. So. That's what they all do. Everything is printed sure. up, so uh, it's sure. kind of well, it's you know even anybody if anybody can make anything. And you know what I mean? Nowadays, so it's so it's like I what, get what, all that. how does um, that really make me any safer? I could just print out a thing that says press badge, and then you guys would be like, hey, cool, okay. Right. And you feel safer. You know what I mean? That's my whole point. Is I, that I got those things don't mean anything. That the Constitution means something, and the Constitution grants me the right to film the police. Mm -hmm. to film in public and this is public and if you would have had a sign that said no authorized personnel restricted area police only i wouldn't be here because i don't break the law so even though that Your wouldn't be a law correct. you know because you guys have the right this people like to say that this is a, a private like you guys are private property it's not private it's public but you do have authority over the property to restrict certain areas like i couldn't oh, sure. go walk it's into one thing the building if you came in here and you wanted to slash all our tires yeah no no completely no or even so. if i went inside i can't walk around your whole precinct no, you certainly so can. yeah there's yeah. public areas in the yeah exactly area, so. so and you well, you, I mean, you make it you a different thing because the building's secured and all that uh -huh, stuff. So exactly you, go you with, secure your areas that you, you don't go want into the lobby and something mm -hmm. like I, I first thing i said to you is look we don't have a fence here so yeah 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 i can put up as many signs as i want yeah somebody wants to walk through here because it's public roads right there and you know I you. like i said i'm just i'm just filming well, i've I never got, been to newburgh before right over here yeah so i'm gonna go check that out by, too by people oh here's a parking lot i'll park here oh that's not town hall that's town hall so yeah they're gonna be walking through and stuff yeah like yeah that. yeah so i get all that it's just what what you were doing again i've said it a couple times now not illegal mm -hmm. um but I, th I think you can understand 
why we would want to know what's going on. No, and I can. And and, and like I said, I think, I think anybody who wouldn't understand that is not reasonable. I'm reasonable. This you're, is your you job. Seem pretty reasonable. This this is this is your job. So this is you're gonna see somebody coming out and filming your cars and filming your building. Sure. You're gonna come out and ask them. It's gonna but, happen. But it you gotta. In the, uh, around here but you so gotta. Much, but... You, you gotta learn how to because you know what that one officer he started escalating. You know that's that's gonna aggravate me. It's gonna aggravate him, and it's only gonna lead to it's only gonna lead to something stupid happening and somebody getting arrested. You know it just it doesn't make sense. We, when yeah. you could just have a conversation. Hey buddy, I know you're not doing anything illegal, but you know, can we talk about it? Right, I could have, I could have been like nope, and just and, and just Absolutely. turned around and said no, and kept walking. Right, but I know that that's only gonna see if I wanted to cause well, a, a you're situation. Not, you're exactly. Not here to it can, exactly. Do something wrong. Exactly. So I have nothing doing, to hide. You're, yeah. You're, that's the only thing. Like I said, my only request. Would Imagine be, I would have done that. Imagine I just would have spun around and kept walking. You know, I'm sure that would be a way for them to get them to do something that I would want them to do for views. Right, but you know. It's it's not about that. It's about education. It's about you know just exercising my rights in a peaceful manner. I got that's you. all we're I doing here. I understand where you're coming from. So that's what, like I said before, my only thing is is if if you're or when you do this again, if mm -hmm. you maybe just stop into the to the lobby and, and yeah. touch base with somebody inside. I was actually like, thinking about doing. I was th I was thinking about uh, next time just being one hundred. Hey, listen, I'm auditing you guys for the First Amendment. You guys, I'm here to exercise my right peacefully. I would appreciate if you obey all laws, respect my rights. And let me continue yeah, about my I business. Think it, I think, it, it, in a way, that's probably better. Yeah. I may, I may even, if you came inside and say, "Hey, I'd like to speak to your sergeant." Yeah. Maybe I'll come out and walk around with you, answer yeah. some questions you have, or anything yeah. like that. Here, that's I'll, good. I'll give you tours. Because we want to. We we'll yeah. give you tour a lot. I'm not going to let you <laughs> touch anything. <laughs> yeah. But you want to look? Go ahead and look. Yeah. Well, it's in public. Yeah. So, Again, like yeah. I said, but you know, I, I think we're on the same page. Yeah. Why, why? Why you were approached initially? Mm -hmm. I know you're not happy with with the uh, the entire interaction to, yeah. the, the just, just beforehand, but I, if you could just you know I'm not I'm not gonna file like a formal complaint against them, but what I would say is you know you seem I'm gonna go inside and talk with them. You right seem now, you seem so. reasonable, so that's what I'm not gonna do. Normally I would, but you seem reasonable, so you know I appreciate it. You know you can't detain people willy nilly. That's you know I know a lot of officers do it, but it's not right. You know you have to have reasonable articulable suspicion. I'm committing a crime, mm -hmm. and which there was none. Well, and helps. then you know escalation is another thing. It helps you know? when when people like yourself know uh, know the process as well. Yeah. So, um, you know, um, uh, I, I I can respect to a degree what you're doing. I Thank you. I, I at least understand it. Yeah. Maybe I don't agree with uh -huh. with everything, yep. but I can at least understand. And that's where you're and that's from, that's so. all and, and that's all I asked for. Uh, yeah. Like I said, you're not here causing a problem, from what I can tell. I don't I don't see anything messed up or damaged or anything like that <laughs> no. and from what i was told you were just looking at things yeah so um again are you are you finished for the day um i'm gonna get a couple more shots and then uh i get out of here yeah okay. i'm gonna just get a couple more shots and be out of here head over to town hall take some pictures over there okay. that's all. all right all right thank you so much sergeant all right take care sir. appreciate you stay safe out there okay all right fellow patriots watching this one brought me right back to that day over two years ago but with a slightly different perspective the first thing that sticks out to me is the sheer ignorance of these two officers. It's absolutely shocking. For an officer to have never heard of reasonable articulable suspicion is mind-blowing. In the hundreds of audits I have conducted across this country, this was the only time I've ever come across something like this. Second thing that sticks out to me is the immaturity displayed. I shouldn't have gone back and forth the way I did. You cannot argue with stupid. The dialogue we had wasn't de-escalating, but escalating because these officers' lack of knowledge and immaturity fueled their ego. If it wasn't for the sergeant arriving on the scene, I surely would have been arrested. Shout out to the sergeant for dismissing these officers, realizing they served no purpose and were only a detriment to the situation. Very smart and professional move on his part. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. As always, stay safe. God bless. I'll see you in the next video. Long Island Audit. Peace.